Hello everybody, welcome to Doing Dental School. My name is Kajal Khatri. I am a first year dental student at Marquette University School of Dentistry. And this week I wanted to just take you along my week in dental school. This is actually a really, really light week for us, which is really exciting because there's a lot of just fun and little different things that I get to do this week. Um, in terms of quizzes and exams, honestly, we had a quiz this morning. Today is Monday and it's um, after classes right now when I'm starting this, but we had a quiz this morning on class two amalgam restorations and using matrix systems and Toffelmeyer. And then we have one more quiz on Thursday. It's an ASCII where we are talking about eccentric movement and eccentric contact. So it's basically all we have this week, which is very, very rare. It's a really, really light week for us. So there's a lot of fun things happening, which I'm going to take you along this week and kind of show you guys. Today is Monday. As I said, it is about 5 p.m. So it's after class. We had preservation and restoration this morning, which is basically the class that we learn how to do preps and how to fill cavities, things like that. And so today, until now, actually, we've only been doing stuff bench top. So we have those um, fake teeth, the type of dance that we use on the bench top, and we're not using the mannequin yet um, and kind of setting it up as if it was a real human person. And so today was the first day that we actually set it up on the mannequin and we practiced doing rubber dams. So we learned how to do them. We had a really long lecture, like it was like two hour long lecture on rubber dams and then they gave us a demo and we got to do them. So I'll insert a photo hopefully of my first one that I did. It definitely ripped like right here. Um, so I redid it and um, ended up getting it the second time, but that was actually really exciting to be able to learn that because that's definitely a fundamental in kind of moving forward with this entire course and with all of dentistry as well. So it was a really cool thing to learn. But yeah, aside from class today, tonight is gonna be a very chill night. Um, some of the fun meetings and activities that I have going on this week kind of happen a little bit later this week, but today is just gonna be very chill. Um, I'm about to have a call with a pre-dental student just to talk about um, dental school which if that's ever something that you guys are interested in I do do like private like one-on-one -on -one calls where we can just talk about whatever so definitely just reach out to me on Instagram if you're like interested in setting up a call but I'm about to do that and then um, after that I'm probably just gonna go down to the gym, um, take some time to just relax, read a little bit tonight, just like take time for myself and take care of my mental health. That's kind of just gonna be probably a theme for this week because this week is very chill and relaxed and I'm really excited if you couldn't tell already. So let's um, hop on that call and then I'm gonna go downstairs. Happy Tuesday. So this morning I have gone to class. We had literally like one hour of class this morning and now I'm kind of free until 2 p.m. which is really nice. It's only like 9 15 a.m. so a big break in the day which is very nice because I have a lot of things to do today. Um, I have a lot of just random things I want to get done, especially with this being a lighter week. I want to make sure that I can film a few videos, especially like pre-dental related videos. I know application season for dental school is coming up, so I definitely want to make a few application related videos as well. So I'm hoping to film at least one or two of those right now. And then I have some random stuff I want to get done for school, just like some note taking and a little bit of studying. And then I'm hoping that at some point today, I can also head down to the gym again and just have time to read and relax again. I'm definitely just taking my time this week to kind of enjoy and take time for myself. But later today at two, I have pathophys from two to about 4.30. So I think today we're talking about gastrointestinal pathology. And then 
later this evening at 4.45 after class, we have an ASDA meeting, which is um, ASDA, if you didn't know, is like the American Student Dental Association. At Marquette, every single student is automatically enrolled in ASDA. The application fee and the membership fee is kind of included in our tuition because our dean thinks that it's very, very important and very beneficial for all of us to be in ASDA. And I definitely agree. I really have enjoyed all of the stuff that I've been involved with so far. And I think this meeting is a general body meeting talking about how you can get more involved and how you can take up leadership positions. So I'm definitely excited to go and learn a little bit more because I'm looking forward to just becoming more involved in ASDA as I go through dental school. So I think it'll be really exciting to go and learn about the positions and learn more about the club today. Okay, it is a little bit later now. It's about 11.15 and I haven't gotten as much as of my to-do list done as I thought I would at this point, but that's okay. I had a video that I forgot that I wanted to post today. I had it all like uploaded and everything, but along with the video, I had like a TikTok and an Instagram story that I all wanted to post at the same time. So that took a little bit of time to make and then I finished a little bit of schoolwork and now I am about to film a video. I think I'm gonna film a video, hopefully two this week. I think I'm only gonna get one done today though, but I think I'm gonna film a video today all about the application timeline because I know I get a lot of questions of like, what am I supposed to start with and like what order does everything go in? Definitely want to make a video specifically about the application timeline. And then I think I'm gonna make another video just on like general application tips. I'll probably wait until tomorrow to film that though. I just want to be thoughtful and intentional in putting the tips together. And I have a whole list right now, but I know for sure like later tonight and tomorrow, I'll probably think of more, especially as I'm talking to friends and stuff. So I definitely want to just wait and take time to film that video before I do. So that'll be the game plan for some of the upcoming videos. We'll sneak peek into what you can expect on my channel coming up, but I'm gonna go ahead. I made a whole outline for the application timeline video. So I'm gonna go ahead and film that first and then probably eat some lunch and head back to school. Everybody. Happy Wednesday. It is Wednesday afternoon right now. I'm gonna chat with you guys while making some afternoon iced coffee. Um, just because I need a little pick-me-up in the middle of the day today. Um, but I'm using, don't judge me, I'm using my leftover coffee from this morning and then I'm gonna, I'll make a little bit more. But um, this morning we have had a full day of classes. We had oral biology this morning, which was very interesting. We've had the same lecturer for two weeks in a row now. And last week she talked all about cleft lip and cleft palate and how that's treated. And then today she talked a lot about different malformations of the mandible and the maxilla and how they can kind of manipulate the bone to make up for some of these um, malformation. So it was very cool and very interesting to hear about. Um, and she's super sweet. She actually brings all of us snacks every time she comes and lectures for us, which is really nice. Um, but after that, we had Pathophys lecture. Also, if you're wondering, I use the Starbucks like instant iced coffee. Um, if you've been following along for a bit you know that i actually work at starbucks and i get these lovely instant coffees when i go to work and so um it's kind of just a fun little pick me up during the middle of the week but um but yeah so we had pathophys after oral bio this morning which ended a little bit early and then after pathophys i actually met with my tutor for dental anatomy we have one dental anatomy quiz tomorrow. It's like an ASCII. 
Um, and so it's all about eccentric context and eccentric movement, which is a really important topic for dental, dental students to know and for dentists to know. And so we actually had a OSCE on the same exact topic last week and we're doing it on the same exact topic this week because he thinks it is that important that we really really master these concepts and it is a really difficult concept if any of you are dental students definitely let me know how you guys kind of learned that and if you have any tips and tricks to share with me because it is a really difficult concept to learn but I met with my tutor she was very helpful as always to kind of just teach me and walk me through some practice questions and then went to gross anatomy lecture. I'm about to take a gross anatomy quiz right now really quick and just finish some of my lab work and then after that this afternoon I have a lot that I want to finish today. Um, I have some cooking that I want to finish. As I said yesterday, I want to film that other video about my tips for the dental school application process. And then um, later tonight, which is very exciting, um, my dog is gonna come and visit here. Um, I told my parents that I would take care of him for a bit while they have to do something else in downtown. They could leave him at home, like he's fine staying at home, but I was looking for an excuse to see my dog. So um, they're gonna bring him here and we're just gonna hang Hang out and study with him for a bit. Okay, so I just finished filming that video that I wanted to film. Um, I thought a lot about the tips that I wanted to share in the video. So um, it was nice to sit down and film that and it'll be nice also like over this next weekend to have a lot of content to edit and upload and i always feel really good especially like when i can pre film a ton of stuff and pre-edit it so that it's kind of scheduled out for the next few weeks so that'll be really nice i'm really glad i got that done and now i think i'm just gonna go downstairs and work out for a bit i feel like i need just to get my body moving and especially with this week having a little bit of extra time it'll be really nice to just go downstairs and get active a bit and then afterwards i'm gonna come back here i'm gonna study for my oski tomorrow cook some food and then my little pup is coming over so i am really really excited just gonna like clean up and make sure he doesn't get into anything at the apartment Hello everybody, happy Thursday. This week is seriously just flying by and I feel like the most exciting parts of this week are actually gonna be today and tomorrow, so I'm very excited. We're actually like done with all of the quizzes and exams for this week. Um, we had our OSCE exam this week that, or this morning that I was telling you guys about and so I think it went pretty well, definitely better than last week's and the week before, so that's good. Um, and so today I'm actually done with classes um, and it's only like one o'clock. I don't have a rotation today. And then tonight we have a lot of exciting things happening. So in about two hours, I actually work at Starbucks. And so I will be going to work. I don't work like very regularly, but I take on shifts anytime I can and anytime I just have a little bit of extra time. I think it's just really fun. Like I don't really do it for the money. The money is nice being paid, but I just think it's really fun and it's good, like relaxing way of kind of just taking a break from school. And I love like, I get in the groove of being on bar and making all the drinks. So I really love it and it's very enjoyable. So I'm gonna go there. My shift is only like three or four hours long. So a super quick, easy shift. And then after that, I have book club. Ser seriously, book club is like what gets me through um, the entire semester. I absolutely love it. Um, this is through ASDA. So 
ASDA has a subcommittee of book club and so they have two meetings every semester. Um, so this is like our end of semester meeting where we talk about the end of the book. This week or this semester we read The Guest List by Lucy Foley which I would definitely recommend if any of you guys are looking for a new book to read. I read the whole thing over spring break and it was definitely a good book. It was different from what I normally read. I normally gravitate towards like romance and definitely like Colleen Hoover books and things like that. So this was definitely different. It's more of like a murder mystery of like they tell the entire story from everyone's different perspectives. And in the book, everyone kind of has a motivation to like kill the one person that's murdered. So it was very, very interesting. I would highly recommend if you're looking for a new book to read, but that is tonight. We also have a class social tonight, which I'm debating if I'll end up going or not it's after book club so a whole series of things happening today um just because i do have my starbucks shift and then i have book club i'm not sure if i'll be up for going to that class social later but we'll see but yeah that'll basically be the plan for today i'm going to just quickly eat some lunch and just relax a bit before i head over to starbucks Okay, so I am going through and editing this video actually right now and I'm realizing that I was kind of a flop at explaining what was happening. I got clips at all of the events that I went to later this week, but I didn't really go through and explain everything. So I thought I would sit down and just explain what all was happening in all of these clips. So as you will see, hopefully on the screen right now, I had book club on Thursday. As I said, I literally live for book club. I absolutely love it. This semester we read The Guest List by Lucy Foley. I would highly recommend, but what we ended up doing for book club is actually going and going to someone's apartment and we had a ton of pizza. Um, I think they ordered from a local pizza shop here and they had like eight huge giant pizzas and they had breadsticks and they actually made milkshakes as well and they had some boozy milkshakes as well. So it was really, really fun. We chatted about the book. We actually voted on our book for the summer semester too. And so I'm really excited. We're actually reading Daisy Jones and the Six, which as I showed earlier in this video, I actually just read The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo, which is by the same author as Daisy Jones and the Six. That's Taylor Jenkins Reid. And so I'm really, really excited about the summer book. The other two options that we had were actually the One Italian Summer. And our second option was actually The People We Meet on Vacation by Emily Henry. And I have that book. I got it literally like last summer, but I still haven't read it because I feel like it needs to be a book that I need to be like on vacation or it needs to be really like nice outside. So I'm excited. I'm definitely going to read probably those other options as well, but we decided on Daisy Jones and the Six, which I'm very excited about. And then on Friday, I only had a little bit of classes in the morning. I'm looking at my schedule here right now, but I only have like four hours of class in the morning, so not too bad. And then that afternoon or that evening, we had Mr. Moeller, which is a show put on by ASDA. And it's basically where it's almost like a male beauty pageant, but it's super funny. It's supposed to be really comedic and just kind of like a way to de-stress as a dental student. So each class elects one student, one guy in the class to compete in Mr. Moeller and there's a lot of like there's a talent competition there is like some super funny introductions stuff like that and it's really nice because we kind of just like sit down we talk about the struggles of being a dental student and so it's really really fun and I definitely enjoyed that and then on Saturday morning we had an oral cancer 5k so SNDA is one of the clubs at Marquette University School of Dentistry and they had an oral cancer 5k which was super fun I signed up with all of my friends. So we ended up walking. It was funny because our first lap, you had to do three laps. Our first lap, I think we were behind some slower walkers. And so it took us 24 minutes to do our first lap. And then the second one, we were speed walking. And I think that second lap, we got down to almost like 16 minutes. So it was crazy, but it was a lot of fun. It was really fun to just like in the morning, they had some raffles and it was a nice way to just start my Saturday morning. So 
I really, really enjoyed this week overall. As I said, it was a really good balance of going to school and doing all of my schoolwork, but then also balancing it with a little bit of fun and especially a lot of school sponsored stuff, which I'm definitely looking forward to getting involved in a lot of other like school sponsored things as we get into the summer and the fall semester. So I had a really great week and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. I will see you next time. Bye.